Okay, then what's uh, what's your stacking strategy there uh, with him, Jeff, with Stamkos? Yeah, so again, if we're starting Stamkos, I mean, you can still, you should probably still play Vasilevsky. We're playing for a blowout Tampa win. So you're saving a bit of money. I would still try and get, you know, access to like the, the Tampa big guns. I mean, you could certainly pair him with like, uh, you know, you know, someone else on, on Tampa, like someone with the second line or something. Maybe you go, maybe you fade Kucherov and then you go Hedman or something. But I think that the play is to get the big three from Tampa in there. Um, that's the guys who are going to ultimately show up and, and probably put a bunch of goals on if we're going that route. So you start with, uh, you know, Kucherov, Vasilevsky um, and, and Stamkos, and then you kind of go down the lineup and, and you just fill it out. And there is plenty, still plenty of filler here that you can get. I mean, Tampa's got a very cheap, like, back end. You know, if they even just get one goal from their their one of their back end lines in, like, a 6-1 game, that could work. But um, I, I think that, you know, again, if you start with Stamkos, that opens you up to being able to stack the big three a lot easier so all right paul who are you stacking with your captain there in the crease well the idea is gonna to get the big points and then the goalie win just to go back to that for a second so that's why i'm going vasilevsky but you got to include at least two of the three stamkos kuchera or headman two of those three guys and then fill in with andre palat this guy's got goals in the last three games so don't overlook him he'll come in cheaper than the other guys too for the rangers you know if it's a low scoring game Go with Shesterkin, but I'm like Je- Jeff picked my score. I-, I think it's gonna be five to one, and uh, Ryan Strom will get the only goal for the Rangers, so that might be a way to fill your lineup.